Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of Immersion Roleplay. Jumping in today with the Blaine County Sheriff Department using the 2000, I want to say 2018 Ford F-250. We got the light bar on it, we got our LPRs, everything. We're going to be jumping in as a 3 Charlie 193. We're going to go get out 10-8. And we're gonna see what we can get into today. Go ahead and hop in the truck and get after on patrol. User was User moved left out of channel. channel. Alright. Uh just real quick, I keep forgetting and I need to do it. I was thinking it, but I didn't do it. Um, about signing into the CAD system real quick. Let's go ahead and make sure that I am logged into the CAD here. And we will get 10-8 for patrol. Alrighty, we are good to go. We're gonna go 1041 10 8 on the cat here let's also sign into the portal real quick and then we'll get it on patrol all right we are signed in we are good to go i don't need that tab open we're gonna minimize that and we are ready to go uh what was it three charlie Three Charlie one ninety three will be ten forty one tonight. Go ahead and go fill this truck up with some fuel. We'll go sheriff today because I did uh, state the other day. So I also wanna, as I said, I will switch between departments for video. So today will be Blaine County. All righty. A VM wearing all black came in the U tool, left the black van. Da, da, da. We're gonna head out to the U tools. Technically, um, I'm gonna just take the back road so that I'm not on the highway. We're in a truck, so. Did she call me? Oh. Your channel. User was moved out of your channel. So I made standing for to uh, another unit that raised a useful be advised to be on the lookout for a white male wearing all black clothing. Last seen in a black van. Last seen going on the dirt road towards Yucca Road at Post Post 313 behind the useful. Oh, that's funny. Petty theft from the Utah, okay. I'm gonna just go last seen location, which is over here. He could have booked it down this road. But he could be long gone. Watching the uh, sky, even though I should be driving. Let's hope today my game doesn't attempt to crash. While we do this. I'm not gonna interfere unless they call me. User was moved User to your channel. Channel. But I'm gonna go check down Route 68. So we're gonna head down Route 68, see if I can spot that van. I think they said black van, so. I mean, it's gonna stick out like a sore thumb because there's no 
AI vans that spun in the county unless it was like one of those rusty old surfer vans so if I was a criminal where would I go I would probably end up going to Harmony so we're gonna go and do a beat sweep while we're looking for this guy Another location I would think of is maybe that town, um, not that town, house at three, I want to say it's three, six, seven. Yeah, three, six, seven, uh, Star Lane could be in that location, but I'm not going to jump to that assumption. Bank seems to be clear. We're just gonna kind of look through Harmony while staying on the main road. But honestly, they could be anywhere. There was a speeding black van almost hit me. I'm almost up that way. I'll just roll that way, code one. Okay, 94, be advised. Uh, after further conversation with the clerk, he has a useful. Sounds like he just came in, stuffed as many items as he could into his uh, cart and van, and he would physically push the staff out of the way. Um Charles one seven I'll be nice this call. Correction in route to call. Route sixty eight bypass. I'm not seeing anything over here. I am not seeing anything, um... By the bypass. I'm over here, but I don't see anything. And the Route 68 bypass is right here. I just drove around the whole thing and saw absolutely nothing. So I don't know if it's this bypass. Is it a Route 68 bypass, right? Route 68 approach. Where's the bypass? Blown broke approach road access trails. I'm just looking at the. Uh, I guess it's like over here, but I just turned around and I saw absolutely nothing regarding it. So they're like trying to figure out, hey, what direction? Because I'm seeing here, I just run around the whole approach and I don't see anything. If that's the officer who just drove past me.
Yeah, so no, right now we're just running. I mean, at this one, I'm gonna head back down Route 68. They said Route 68. I'm gonna go. If I was a black van, then my vehicle is damaged. I'm gonna just check up here. I'm not gonna go far. But I'm gonna put my detective skills to work. I got a canis. Mesa parked here. What's the plate on it? See if it's registered. Um, my ch lucky choice would be. Hang on. I'm gonna run the license plate of zero four. Um, hotel king. Um. Zero for a hotel kilo. I'm gonna use Q for queen. One zero five. All right, so that play is even registered. Okay. I wish there was something I could show you guys, but a cat is outside the game, so. I'm not seeing anything up here on this here dirt road. I'm gonna check the back roads. I'm gonna go all the way up to Madrazo's place and just look. There's a Ford a Raptor driving down the road. But I don't think anyone's gonna be up this way. So I'm going to check up on these dirt roads here up near the radio station See if there's anything up here Any black vans the nice rebel Radio station Go ahead and head down this Way. Um, I'm gonna pause here just for half a second. Ah, shit. Drop my remote. No one else has really said anything. I guess. We're looking around for that black van. The Route 68 approach was completely clear. I don't know where else that black van could be. But, um. I'm trying to think if. They said the vehicle was him involved in hit and run going towards Joshua from Panorama. Well, that black van could be anywhere. That's what I'm going to do. Because we're hunting around for it. I want to guess maybe if I got in a hit and run, I'd go to Stab City. That's just a gut failing, but I could be 110% wrong. Let's go ahead. I'm gonna check towards Stab City.
over here. Yes, technically this is all my jurisdiction. I have the whole county. By the fact that they are just chilling. Ford Raptor there. I'm not really seeing anything that screams black van. It could be anywhere in Sandy, Grapeseed. Like, we're looking for one vehicle. Man, this truck loves to burn out. Oh, hey, we have an Amazon Prime trailer. That's neat. I thought that was a cop just sitting there. This is what I might do. I might duck into a bush. Or just park myself somewhere in Sandy and see if uh, I'm gonna go check the Ace of Liquor. Right now, we're just patrolling around. I know right now you guys are probably gonna be bored, but something will happen. I'm pretty sure of it. Dang, I am whipping this truck. I'm about to do some fishing. Be like a mid trooper uh, Bennett. Pull out that AI pulling. But uh, right now, I might see much. It'd be nice to get some clouds up in the sky. Stop, he just went for it. I'm just driving. I'm gonna go sit right here. I really like this truck. I'm trying to remember what I used in the first episode. I think it was 
I'm trying to think of the cards I used in the first episode, but I have to go back and watch the footage. But in each episode, as I said, we're gonna go through all the different cars for the between the three departments, right? So like episode one was state. I think I actually used this truck, but I'm using it as sheriff. Small fire near Route 6828. 258. 258. I'm right near there. As I almost hit the sign, I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna go ahead and attach. I don't see a small fire. I don't see anything. There is no fire. Oh, damn. I did not even see it. I was sitting there like... I was just... Actually, I'm not gonna worry about it. Damn, bro. I didn't even see this and I drove right past. This is cutty. Hey. How's it going? Fine. <laughs> I'm surprised the van turned up, honestly. There's the fire truck. I go ahead and move my truck so that fire can fire can pull up. I'm gonna pull, move my truck behind the Tahoe here. Let's go ahead. I didn't realize that um, they're rolling with a vest. I'm not. You do not have a low enough hose. You don't have enough hose. I feel like his hose is gonna Damn that's a long ass hose Well shit That's a That's a long ass hose then Well shit I was just in the area when I saw it I hope that didn't come through. Dang, 86 degrees today. Phew. Ah, shoot.
Got my phone. Don't want to break it. I like how he just drives with a blank pet plate. For me, I just set it as my unit number. Name, son. Well, that was interesting. I thought I'd say all evidence would be destroyed. So, yeah. Going to her the dollar pills. I'm gonna go over. Hey, it looks like the footprints that are go off uh, in that direction, uh, up the ridge. If you want to follow those, with uh, I'll have the other guy come over here. I'll stay with fire. All right. He said up and over the ridge. He said it looks like any footprints near. Are there any footprints? Yeah, male. Size 11 footprints go into dollar pills. And the dollar pills is, um, so I'm gonna go up and over the ridge. Dollar pills is right here. So I'm gonna f go up and over the ridge. Let me go ahead and just park my... I can't forget what key was my lock key, but... Let me... Um... Okay, that tree is jank. I was gonna say... He said up and over the ridge. So I'll follow this guy. Because it looks like there's a blood. I was gonna I was gonna hit the dirt road and go to a dollar pills You got this shack up here That's a cliff It's a good thing I didn't like my vehicle Oh, that was a quick change of weather, Jesus. Huh? Now the only footprints I got are my own. Me and this other guy are investigating he said up and over the ridge to her dollar pills but they can go anywhere i'm not seeing tire marks or anything gotta do some knocking Yep, I'll check this house over here. This is what T slash
Draw heads all the way over to the Draw leads all the way over to dollar pals. That's why I was gonna take my truck is because if he walked on foot where So I could do this so T slash G I C not Oh, he did it. Me and another deputy stopped by in the last 10 15 minutes. So, okay, I'm going to stop the animation. Yeah, I'm ready. Yeah. Uh, I'm waiting for my monocles to back me, but so far, nothing. Uh, yeah, I'm getting nothing. I'm about to say dollar pills is... I would have just brought my truck. I guess the trail... Leads to Dollar Pills and Dollar Pills is over that ridge. If I was him, I would have gone this way and up and over the ridge to Frodo. All right, just on my dog. So I'm helping him investigate. These are a really good episode so far, I would say. Not high action, but... Hey, should we be worried about that mountain line right there? That's why I pulled the gun. <laughs> keep He's... walking, but watch. Pull out my clock here. Like, shouldn't we be worried about that mountain lion? You want to stop by and talk to these people real quick? I'm gonna keep going. Yep, I can do that. Yep. I'm gonna put the gun away. Uh, she's drinking. I think she'll tell me we have an update. Her uh, bystander, they saw a break. Uh, WMA with a black hoodie, with a black face mask, black uh, pants, black boots, the backpack. 
So we need to always stop talking to these people. Alright, they're gonna run around. I guess he went down to the parking lot. Oh yeah, we got floating trees. So he is... There's not really a good way to go down this hill. I'm just roll down the hill. He said back parking lot. Go for one ninety three. Three Charles. If you can go ahead and go into your vehicle, then ten four again. Shot by the area. Ten four on the area. I I sprint all the. Alright, let's avoid Mountain Lion at all costs. Neutral uh, from one, uh, neutral from seven, are you okay? Neutral lady from one, four, seven. He didn't say. Yeah, sorry, I was running back to my vehicle. Yeah, go run, go grab it. Yep. He's like, Jesus, you scared the crap out of me. I'm like, I am so sorry. on the uh, road. Alright. I'll make sure he's alright. I'm gonna head back to um, the dollar pills. I'll figure out my door lock when I am done. I had on my delete key. Seems like those guys are. Hey Charles, lady, hey Charles, one nine four seven. Hey Charles, lady, hey Charles, one four seven. No. Advise, I had an OIS versus an aggressive mountain lion. Uh, do you want to come down here and handle it, or just have County CSI come up here and process it? I didn't even touch that trailer, but oh. Okay. 
Where that uh, yeah, officer? I'm at. I am over at the uh, Dollar Palace. Copy, can I you come up here and we just uh, see? I took a phone from the rear parking lot. Uh, if you just come up here and assist me, we just sit uh, with the mound line real quick. Time for. I think he's what up here on the ridge. Not too steep. Hold up right, hold, hold right there. Yep. Freaking mountain lion came at me. Yeah, I th think we were. Probably was the same one that we just saw was sleeping. It might have. I'm not sure. It was over there. Yep, that was the same um, one that was sleeping. Yeah, it was. It might not. It might. It was. Might have been the same one. I'm not sure. If yeah. Sent over by like that far tree over there, like the white one. Yeah, I see it's which one you're talking about. Well, it came running at me, so I put like probably four or five rounds in. I had most of them, then I was able to get back up, so I had to empty probably about the rest, yeah. probably about 12 rounds total, and then finally dropped them. Dang, that's a lot of rounds. Yeah, so, um, well, at least you're alive. <laughs> yeah, he didn't even really come close, but yeah, no, I actually got pretty close. I was probably right about where he. <laughs> Probably right about there. So he actually got pretty close, but not. He wasn't coming out like a full charge or anything. Yeah. Howdy. Howdy. Freaking mountain lion came at me. Nice. <laughs> Never see a so mountain lion way over here, though. Usually they're out there in the mountains. Yeah. I guess new uh, <laughs> wildlife. Usually, so this is any... shots unrelated to the mountain lion, or we were running over to uh, investigate. That's when the mountain lion came uh, to me. So the second round of shots was unrelated. Gotcha. Where'd the first round come from? You said west, right? I have. Uh, east. They were like over there. East. -ish. Gotcha. Kind of like panic. That's why I was concerned because they were kind of sound like they were close to where the fire had been. All right. So. Um, yeah, I got it. Mm. Right. I, uh, in the weird parking lot, I found a phone abandoned. If someone wants to take this, just gloved mm -hmm. up. Uh, uh, I just had it in my pocket, and I ran over one of the shots. Yeah, let me go grab my gloves from my car. Mm -hmm. If you, uh, Debbie, you can just probably take them. Yeah, I can. Yeah, just take that, then just like, I guess CID can process if they really want to. And I'm sure if it's a lady, but it's just abandoned in the weird parking mm. lot. Yeah, I can take back to the station, they can investigate it. When we're done here. Then, I, I, it was in the back park lot, I guess. <laughs> um, so, oh, what's it called? Um, mm -hmm. So someone, if um, I'm probably good here now. If someone wants to go over there and just check, see if there's any rear CCTV to see if there's anything growing that's found. Yeah, kind of back towards, okay, northeast gotcha. parking lot, a uh, northwest corner of the back parking lot. Of the mm -hmm. uh, dollar post over here, yeah. right? I got you. <laughs> I'd say it's probably whoever we're looking for through their phone. Yeah, it might have been. But then they can't be tracked. Yeah. The shame because I'm going to have to actually probably see them down here go signal 42, so. Yeah. Yeah. Um. So, um. Yeah, I'm just going to go retrieve my vehicle. I'm going to go signal 42. So if you have fun with this. Yep. I'm looking at that vehicle over there because it's it's weirdly parked up on that ridge. So Mountain Lion County can come clean her up. I'm gonna turn my lights off. Um I'll take the phone back to the station. But I am gonna head since I'm in a truck, technically I could drive back down there, but I'm gonna take the trail back. I'm gonna go investigate this car over here real quick, though. See if he has anything. 
He might actually be C. Oh, no. Oh, that's just a random Granger. Shots fired near Joshua Road near Harmony. Three Charles from 93. I'm going to go investigate that. Shots fired call. He said Joshua near Harmony and as right. Over here. So this video might be a longer video. It'll be fine. I would love to record this in two parts, but I don't want to bust out near. They said Route 68 near Joshua. That's an AI. I'm gonna shut off my lights. Seven Charles one ninety three. I see a fire burning from one of the buildings nearby. Um Looks like it's going to be a residential house fire. Yeah, come from right here. Copy. Alright, I'm gonna park right here. Oh. Three Charles one ninety three explosion just went off at two twenty eight Joshua Road. So they just blew up something. I don't see anything, but I'm gonna stay back. So this has just turned into an adventure at this rate. I know that one sh unit drove right past. I gave him location 228 Joshua Road. There's a fire burning explosion just went off. So whoever our guy is, he is here. This location. Because shots fired. I come around the corner. I see a fire. So I call it out. We got fire in route. Um... I'm not gonna get close because I'm away for fire to get on scene. Um, it might be best for fire to maybe pull up to the entrance here and extend their hose. But there are, um, I think there's a generator. There's some oil um, barrels right over there. While I'm here real quick. Um, I want to check my key bindings for because I need to remember what is my lock key car locks lock son oh it's my comma key So fire is going, um, I think they're in route code. They should be in route. I said 228 Joshua Road. Um, I'm the only unit on scene. I don't think there's a fire hydrant near by, but I can check. It's a bit iffy because there is no fire hydrant. There's a bunch of old tires. 
there's no fire hydrant so they're just gonna have to hook up to the truck and go unless there's a back side yeah there is no fire hydrant so The problem is it's in such a bad spot. There is no fire hydrant near this business. Unless they're just using the fire truck. Which they are. So no, it was one big gas um, explosion. I went looking around for a fire hydrant, but there is none here. I'll park my truck right here. Alrighty, um... Yeah, there was nothing here. I didn't hear shots fired when I rolled up. I thought there was another unit coming over here. But I guess not. Oh, that garage opens, but there's no interior, I don't think. But it looks like maybe one of the barrels exploded. So uh, I can see if we have any investigation units. But. Pretty much, if, even if you're not investigations, you can. I'm gonna wait back here for it all clear. That Lincoln unit should be coming over here to assist. It's in such a bad spot that there is no fire hydrant. It was pretty blazing on from one of the buildings nearby, but it would be hard to So I'm gonna let firefish on their thing. I thought Ray would have been on. We're gonna finish up the scene and then we will wrap up this episode. This one's gonna be a long one, so but right now if you I know it was a bit boring at times, but then we got led on to an investigation, so. Um. So they're using their tick system, check for hotspots. Um. So I'm gonna run a small investigation. See, I would say it would be the fire's job to see what caused the fire. Because what it looks like to me is that a barrel tipped over. It was probably oil or something. And went bang. I'm waiting for. I gotta take a phone down. County investigations determines that a vehicle fire start from the gasoline being lit on fire. Many tools were found inside the, the back of the van. Well, that would have been part of the information to find earlier. So I was really still investigating that van. That's actually some good work. I give him credit for that. I think I've been in server, I wouldn't say at least five days. So I have 10 days left before I can go for any subdivision. So probably um, investigations is going to come up to where I'll probably be running investigations a lot. So no hot spots. All right. All right. I'm gonna take over. I'm a and I'm gonna pull my truck up and investigate. I'm gonna let fire go. And then I'm gonna run and investigate. Back of the van as well. 
I would see what this fire was started from. Alrighty, so he said that we're gonna finish. Technically, this episode will be a nice long one. So let's go ahead. D slash G I C. At two two eight. So I'm gonna run an investigation over here at two two eight. I guess I'm um, the one guy who is gonna be in route is investigating the call over um investigating that black fan that we found like i want to say 20 minutes ago so this episode is in probably a long one i might even i might um because i'm going on an hour recording this video i'm actually going to go ahead and explain the part two because i want to keep going so this is what we're going to do, guys. While we are um, fishing up, fishing up this investigation, looks like someone poured gasoline all over one of the rooms where it looks like it was three boxes of ammunition. Okay. So this is what we're going to do, guys. I'm going to wrap up this episode of IRP. You guys see you guys back in part two. So it'll be both recorded same day, FYI. I will see you guys in the next one.